Michelle, my name is Jonathan Kale. This video right here, I just want to make um, a shout out to um, the brother Geno Ark, uh, G E N O A R K. Um, very anointed brother, a uh, holy man of God. <clears throat> I love him, you know what I'm saying, the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, well, I just want to inform you, brother Geno Ark, and um, all you two uh, subscribers out there, men of God, women of God. That Gino Ark is a, a true man of God, and um, and I just want to put that out there. Um, I had a, a demonic attack the other day. This was um, on the eighth. Uh, this was on the eighth. The day was the eighth. Let me check it out real quick and see what the day the eighth was. The eighth was on a. The eighth was this Monday. Oh, last Monday. So I was literally a week from from now. And so, um, I'm not gonna go in detail about everything, but I will explain some things. And um, what happened was, I saw Gino Ark in a um. This was a dream. I saw Gino Ark in a in a, in, a, in a dream, and he was. He was covered in blood. He had like blood around his forehead and it was drips of blood. And then I also saw like the drips fall on his head. And I thought, you know, maybe this is him like covered in the blood, like maybe the blood of the Lord or whatever. And um and then I realized it was something else, like something evil. And I saw a Chinese letter or word that I saw on his neck, and it was written in blood. Cause see, Gino Ark, he's Chinese, and um, and 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 the le the um, the letter, it was a Chinese letter, but it was written in blood, and so um, or you know, it was either a letter or a word, but I believe it was a Chinese letter, and so I saw this on his neck, and it was written in blood, and it was blood all around his forehead. Then I started praying for, for him. You know what I mean? I started praying for him, and um. And I started binding up demons in the spirit realm. And because I wasn't fully asleep, because I wasn't fully asleep when this happened. I was half asleep. So that's why this this was an attack that I never had. And um so what started to happen was um um demons started to like um try to like make haunting sounds towards me and try to uh uh incite fear upon me, you know what I mean, and um, and so what happened was, uh, you know, it was, it was really, it was really something else, but, but it didn't, it didn't go forth, it didn't, it didn't, um, overwhelm me, it didn't overtake me, but I couldn't breathe, I was suffocating, and, um, you know, they had me bound, you know, the usual sleep paralysis, but the only thing that was really so, so different in, in this experience that I've experienced other than any other experiences that I wasn't fully asleep that's what really like bothered me about this one because I wasn't fully asleep and um and I knew what was going on like full throttle I knew all the way 100% like this was going on full throttle and um you know so I started pleading the blood of, I started uh professing the name of Jesus I started saying I I rebuke you in the name of Jesus over and over. And um, then I saw the computer screen, a, a, a desktop like I have. Okay. Um, and now when I saw this computer screen, I saw like how you see like on the TV, like when you got those like those fizzy channels that don't work and stuff like that. Well, that's what I was seeing, but it was in pink. And then from there I saw fire. And in this fire I saw a eye. It was like a snake eye, a slit, and it was right in the middle of the computer. And it was a bunch of fire. And I knew that this fire was very, very uh demonic. I knew it was very, very wicked fire. This wasn't no holy purifying fire. This was demonic fire. This was fire, uh like hellish type fire. And um, and this is what I was seeing while I was um, suffocating, 
And while I was um, professing Jesus, I was I was proclaiming Jesus and rebuking these demons in the name of Jesus. And um, and eventually they left. Um. So uh. Yeah. It was very unholy fire, and um, this 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 eye was like the eye of a snake. It was a very thick slit. It was like right in the middle, like I said. And um, as I said, they they eventually left. And as I'm hearing right now, I even heard a spark in the computer. Um, I rebuke you, Satan, right now in the mighty name of the Lord Yahashua Hamashiach. Right now, Lord God, cover this whole situation in blood. Right now, in the blood of Jesus Christ, thank you, Lord God. You are the ultimate sacrifice, the Lamb of God. Amen. Um, I want to let you guys know that there are demons inside of these computers. They're trying to, you know, do a whole bunch of stuff. It's been many times, okay, I've had times where I've failed and stuff. It's been many times where you could be looking at something on YouTube or you could be looking at something or whatever. And next thing you know, you see, you look to the side and you see something that you know. You're like, man, that was, that had to be Satan because it might be like some some half-naked woman or some naked woman. And it's like after you. I, I made a video a while back to show you guys um all these people who were trying to befriend me on Facebook. And there was a bunch of like people who were like Freemasons. All these people had like Freemason symbols. They all had like some type of Freemason right, some Scottish right, some Egyptian Freemason right. He was either like that or like these people were like from like Barcelona, Spain. And they were all very different and weird and they were all connected to like Freemasonry. You know what I'm saying? And so, you know, these spirits are real. They're manifesting. You know what I'm saying? It's real. It's very, very real. I want you guys to know that it's very, very real. It's no coincidence that these demons were um, doing the things that they were doing and they were shown and I was being shown the computer because first of all they want to lure us they want to distract us and I've been distracted many a times behind the computer and the Lord constantly always but thank God for his mercy and grace and always constantly like listen you know and um, you should be spending time in prayer and stuff like that and so you know I'm not going to be one of those YouTube people who be like, you know, I spend, I I do spend hours in prayer, yeah, but I'm not gonna boast in that, you know what I'm saying? Because we, I, I can always do better. I can always do better, you know, because nothing really compares to when I was in prison. I had it all day, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's now you got responsibilities, and sometimes come home, I just want to lay back and stuff like that, and that stuff is like that's where the enemy tries to work. So I want to expose this so we can all know this because we're at a time where we're going to need to be praying real strong you know what I'm saying we're at a time where we're going to need to be in an accessory prayer um, sending petitions because America is about to uh, endure a lot of tribulation a lot of great tribulation and so basically I just made this video you know what I'm saying to expose these demons that are manifesting you know what I'm saying I just saw a video today man um, I put it on my Facebook page too but um, it was a uh, a woman, she was, um, she was possessed, uh, or she became possessed, rather, with the demon, and, um, she was, uh, doing a makeup tutorial, because I was, yeah, you know, I preach on my Facebook page, and I was on there preaching and stuff like that, and, um, sometimes I might see a video, because I'm, I'm connected to some other Christians, I might see some videos that they post up, and I might send it to my page or whatever, and, um, make some type of um, discussion about it and preach about it and, and give my opinion and give a biblical um, standpoint and so uh, what happened was um, I saw this one video and then it led me to go deeper because I know that that word cosmetology and the whole makeup thing it comes from like you know dealing with cosmos and it deals with a whole bunch of different crazy stuff like and so anyway uh, I just ended up I couldn't find it I just put up um makeup demon or something like that and man the first thing I saw was this video of this woman uh, and she was doing a tutorial of how to put on makeup and man she started bashing and then, okay before she even uh, finished the tutorial 
uh, as she was talking, she was real hype, real zealous, real spunky and stuff, black lady, and um, and next thing you know, she froze and just like zoned out. She just zoned all the way out, and then this was for a long amount of time, and then she just started bashing her face into the computer. Now, it looked like she died because like she continued to bash her face into the computer, and um, it's a very horrific video. You know what I'm saying? Um, blood was gushing out of everywhere out of her head it looked like a chunk of meat like her possibly her brain like this was not fake this was very real and Satan don't even want me I know probably a lot of y'all already seen it but I'm still exposing it because this stuff has to be exposed Satan don't even want me to probably talk about this you know what I'm saying um and, and so I need to talk about this um I mean you know he doesn't want us to talk about how you know the influence of spirits and and how they manifest and how they they're real and how they really can but see I want to help you all too a Christian can be demonized but they can't be possessed now this lady I don't believe she had the Holy Ghost she was possessed possessed means full uh, takeover she was subdued by demons now we can be demonized which means to be um highly influenced by demons which is not a great thing you know what I mean but it's better than being possessed and um, I don't want to make light of being demonized because you know what I'm saying it's all about entertaining those demonic whispers and who knows what they can cause you to do but they cannot take over you but they can take over anybody who's a sinner so if anybody's looking at this video send this to some sinners you know what I mean if you don't mind because um the Holy Ghost is what we're possessed with as Christians and um he is the one who has bought us with a price the Spirit of Christ has bought us with a price and um the Holy Spirit and the Spirit of Christ are one in unity and uh, you know it's a beautiful thing that we uh, are not uh, such great victims like these sinners who are but we need to pray for them and we need to really just uh, have an open heart that man these people just don't know no better you know what I'm saying they, they know right from wrong you know what I'm saying I'm not saying that but I mean like they really have been blinded by the enemy and so uh, it's real and um that's what I always say in my videos. I say it's real and it is what it is and stuff like that. <laughs> and it is. And but 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 I also just want to emphasize, you know, God bless you, brother Gino Ark. You know what I'm saying? If 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 I saw you like that and I saw that they hate you that bad, then keep on pushing, brother. Keep on pushing. You know what I'm saying? They 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 hate you that bad. That means God loves you that much more, and you're doing the mighty will of God, and you're doing the work of God. And I saw you. Your street preaching and all that kind of stuff, and and I see you out there, you zealous for the Lord. I, I've 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 followed you for a while, and I don't follow a whole. I don't really follow too many people. It's very small, cause you know what I'm saying it's a lot of suspect people out here. You know what I'm saying it's a lot of suspect people, but um, but but you'll know those who are really real. Um, Satan gets angry, and so you know Satan was pissed off. So that means I'm happy. God bless you, brother. And I was praying for you. I just want you to know that I was praying for you. I'm going to continue to pray for you. And I'm putting this video out there so that other Christians can have you in mind. And all the subscribers, uh, I'm, uh, y'all got to know him because he, he's more popular than, you know what I'm saying? If y'all know me, you should know him. So, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm one of those, you know, little guys and stuff like that in the cut. But um, Gino Arc, he, he, he's, he's not, you know, shy. And he, he, he does great videos, so I want you guys to um to check him out. You know what I'm saying? He's always making videos and um they're always anointed. So God bless you all. Thank you for listening.